On Thursday, September 28th, a group of 70 Shelby Valley High School students were invited to Pikeville Medical Center's Workforce Innovation Center as part of the first 2023 Healthcare Career Spotlight. The students were given insight to the rapidly growing medical field in Eastern Kentucky, as well as a chance for some hands-on learning. Pikeville Medical Center plans to invite other high schools throughout the school year. We feel it's critically, critically important to reach out to these sophomores, these juniors. They still have some time as far as dual credit opportunities are concerned. If they get an idea of perhaps what they might want to do in healthcare through one of these uh, career spotlights. And what it does is gives them time to take some of those dual credit classes so that when they graduate from high school, they have an opportunity to go into some of these programs that we have right here in our region, right here in our area, through Big Sandy, through UPI, through ANU, through Galen, so they can go ahead and, and make preparations for any post-secondary type of education that they're looking for. At Appalachian Wireless, we have the best service and the best deals right now. Save up to $500 on iPhone 13s and 14s, all models, all gigabytes with trade-in. Maybe go for an iPhone 12 for a penny, a penny with a two-year contract. We're not leaving out Samsung. Save up to $350 on select Samsung devices, including the S23. It's a win-win this month at Appalachian Wireless. The service, the savings, y'all got to jump on this deal right now. At Appalachian Wireless, we get you because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Wireless. PMC staff and other local healthcare entities were in attendance to engage with the students. The goal was to demonstrate the opportunities for medical careers in the region. Being here today it helps me see all the opportunities there are, like that I can do around home. And not just that, you can just do nursing at like to be in the healthcare. I actually want to be a radiology tech and this helps um, like last year I think we had like we had nowhere near as much of like hands-on activities and stuff. Um, I think we had like maybe four stations to go to. Um, with like the EMTs here and everything else, it helps a lot. I think people will see and get like more active and stuff like this. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.